I can describe Mark in one word, but I'm going to give you nine words. Inspiring, selfless, kind, compassionate, virtuous, honorable, upbeat, hopeful, and faithful. Well, when I think of Mark, evoking high school memories is smart, high energy, uh, a lot of fun, uh, and kind of willing to try anything. Okay, anything's fair game. When I think of my dad, um, I think of humbleness, um, generosity, just being there for the family, being at all my soccer games when I was a kid. Um, I always remember family dinners. He was the best dad I feel like you could have. I miss him. My dad, the most humble person you'd ever meet, probably one of the most brilliant storytellers you'll ever meet. Mark uh, inspired people uh, by doing and by uh, caring about other people, by being uh, unfailingly kind, uh, uh, trying to be uh, generous with his time and his money. So I just like to try to be more like Mark uh, in that regard. Uh, so, um, you know, just trying to live like he did. Somebody said to me, like, if you could, three words to describe my dad, and it's funny, it always comes back to loving. Loving, and loving is such a big word, but it's, he truly loved my mom, loved Bourbon Day, loved giving, loved. So that's, I really think of just that word when it comes to my dad. When I think of Mark, the thing that comes to mind the most is Mark's generosity, not only with his wealth, but with his time and his energy. He always had time uh, for other people, and especially young people. They were uh, a special uh, project of his to try to help them uh, particularly get educated. He immediately got the mission of the school. He was very supportive. He and Sharon hosted a salon at their home. He was a regular contributor. He would call me frequently saying if anything I could do, I would call him like for legal advice. He was just always available. I think in the gospel somewhere it says, you know, don't let your left hand know what your right hand is doing because that's how he was generous. Um, I don't think it'll ever be known all the things that he did. And we at O'Melveny know how much the school meant to Mark because of how often he mentioned it and how passionate he was about it. He was especially proud of the corporate work study program and for several years arranged for O'Melveny to participate in it, giving students the chance to experience working in a big law firm. I know what he would say to the students of Urban Day would be that he is so proud of each and every one of them for getting to where they are. He would believe in them, whatever they thought that they could do, he would, he would let them know that they could do it. As far as how I'm gonna honor Mark, Personally, I'm, uh, I'm gonna stay involved with Verbum Day. He's the one that kind of pushed me over the top to get me involved. So I'm gonna continue doing that. It's really good that we're remembering Mark, and, and not just because he was a supporter of Verbum Day, but because he was really a wonderful human being. He was warm, he was generous, he had a strong moral compass. He was completely committed to his family. He's the kind of person that we would like to multiply many times over. And if we were to do that, this would be a much better world.